here in the farm. I'm in the vegetable garden, mid-March 2021. And I'm sure you know what this is. Cabbage. Let me get in close here. The cabbage looks good. I've got a couple of them. Here's another one that's doing pretty well. Um, that's a cabbage that hasn't, hasn't done yet. And it's right next to the broccoli. And the, these are same season. Well, there's, there's some cabbage right here. And in this cabbage... I have something eating it. And... Uh, Get some worms and then they'll eat the, the outside of it. Dig down. You can usually peel it away and then go ahead and it, it's um, it's actually pretty delicious. Um, so so the idea is to let these get nice and hard. And if you, you hit them, oh, this is really nice and hard. Um, this one I could actually um, propagate, uh, actually harvest. And um, if you noticed over here, here's some that aren't there yet. Little ones. Um, it's the end of the season, so these will end up being a smaller. Um, and, it, and if I, if I, you know, get the broccoli plants out, that more sunlight um, and more nutrients will come to it. Like I, I take care of the the bolting broccoli. So, so these cabbages. Um, this is how I harvest it. Let me get in here real quickly. So basically, I take it down. All right. I can I can pull it up, okay? And I pull away all the leaves that I don't want. Cut it, cut it right in here. Cut it right here. Take this, peel it a little bit more, and I, and I don't have two hands to do it. Peel it a little bit more, and when I do that, it ends up being delicious cabbage. Nice and hard. I mean, this is nice and hard. Um, hang on a minute. There we go. It's odd shaped, however, still delicious. I'll go ahead and take that and end up putting it on the table here, cleaning it, washing it, chopping up, making a salad for from it. And that is cabbage here on the farm.